Hello, welcome to this stream today. I just had uh, one of my users saying that uh, I should shoot a video on how to populate your Metamax with some, you know, tone of eaters that had had provide. And as you can see, you can see my um, <laughs> Hadat has about thousands of eaters for development purposes. So I don't think I've actually had a tutorial where I address that. So I'm going to show you how to do that and, you know, make sure that you have enough or sufficient eater to perform your, um, uh, your development purposes on your web tree project. All right. So if you're set for that, let's jump into the tutorial. Make sure you smash that like and subscribe button, and then I'll see you in the tutorial. So right now you can see on this screen, I only have one account here and on this platform if i want to create a new account and i use this it's only going to tell me i should create an account too and this still would not have any form of uh it has on it so i can't use this method okay so i can't use this account i have to use uh, a different method of going about it so how do i get that method okay whenever you you want to uh, to get as many eaters as possible on your local uh, on, for development. Make sure that you come to this. If you're in Sapulet testnet, you understand. You have to leave that network and come to local hosts. Okay. And at most times, the local the whole local host need to have like a server, a blockchain server running. And the two blockchain servers that I know that works just fine is Hadad Node and and this in Ganache, you know, uh, servers. Hadad server and Ganache server, which is basically what Truffle uses. Okay, so uh, to get the server working, uh, the this you must spin up a server first of all. So I would suggest that if you don't have a hard art project, you create one and uh, let me open this particular project. This is a hard art project. I want to open it in the terminal and it's on the terminal right now. So I'm going to spin up this server and because if I try to like go to this hard art right now, you see that it cannot connect because the network, there's no network. So right now I'm going to come here and say, yarn hard hat node and then it will spin up this server with multiple uh, keys private keys and you know public keys okay so but what we need is the private is the private keys that is what you need to import your uh, some some tokens into some eaters into this project so right now i'm going to click on this and click on this you see that the account now is now available for me okay but this is not the account this is not the account that i'm looking for i'm not looking for uh this uh this sort of account it's not going to be useful to for what i want to use it you can use create account use import account so you click on this import account and you're going to have to import private keys and not json so this is where you're going to enter your private key so come to this place, select, let's say the for account number one, select the private key. Don't select this key. Select the private key, copy and paste it here, then import it. You see that 1000 eaters now available for you to use in your development process. Isn't that cool? So you can import as many as possible. So let's click on this and import another one. Let's import this one. Uh, you copy here and paste import that you have another 1000 eaters and let's do it one more time let's import one more account okay and yeah copy that paste this and uh, import that so you have about uh three uh that is three account loaded with you see you can they are marked imported three account loaded with three free eaters that you can use you know in performing all your metamask transaction for hard art project okay like i say there are more than one way of doing this thing this is just one method and i guess i should teach you how to use ganache as well uh let's search for ganache cli okay and this is a package 
that can also help you you can install this package globally on your machine and you know unlike the way i actually run this hard art project on a specific project hard art project you know i don't need to do that when i'm running this one it says this is depreciated i'm sure there is a new version of this around but you can install this globally on your machine like npm install dash g ganache dash cli once you once you install it let me quit this you can actually run ganache dash cli you know dash dash version and run that and if it is installed you see the version will pop up on your machine right there okay so but there is something we want to start spin up this ganache server okay uh, to spin up the Ghana server right now if I refresh is um, this let's say I switch network let me come back here okay it's not recognizing this network anymore there is nothing on the network so but then let me spin up the Ghana server to spin up a Ghana server I say Ghana that CLI and then dash a for account and then it will spin up actually 10 account for you and each these are the, the accounts and these are the their private keys okay so uh, let's try to sw switch to this localhost connection okay it is functional now but uh then since it is functional you can actually then import some account into the network so you can copy this but why i will tell you not to copy this is because take a look at this it ends with what 07 f2b let me quit this and run this again the first account now ends with what bda you see it's completely generating a fresh account every single time you run this command so you don't want this because if you do this this way you have to be entering changing the account on your metamax uh uh, interface so you don't want to be doing that because that is very redundant and very tiring so for you to stop to to make sure that the accounts are deterministic are uh, always bringing uh exactly the same kind of number just like with the hard art uh, uh, server what you need to do for the ganache is to actually do ganache instead of dash a to dash d this will make it deterministic so that at every single time that you run this command it will always end with 3bd 3b1d so let's quit it run this again see that it always ends with that so it's not consistent so with this now you can copy this and you know import that into yeah you see it's right there three, uh, 100 it so ganache server enables you to actually install you know also copy and paste and add more accounts yourself you know if you want to use ganache server or you want to use um hard hard server any one of them hard hard server is pretty cool because it gives you 10,000 eaters why this ganache server give you only a hundred okay so that's the difference between them and i hope that this uh this has been very very uh useful to you and if it does if it is useful to you make sure you smash that like and subscribe button and hit the notification bell for more videos like this okay all right um i have a book out there you know you should grab a copy you know if you want to support me you can buy me a coffee here or you can just support me by purchasing this book too is just that is not much of a uh it's not costly so you just get one of the copy and help yourself improve in your smart contract development and blockchain development in general so this book is quite important and i you know we uh recommend this book for you and if you want my services i have other services available for me you know here my cons hourly consultants in my classes and you know hourly development service services as well so all that make sure you check it out and you know and <laughs> patronize it so with that said i'm going to end it here and i will see you in the next video peace